call upon the Lord in distress. The Lord answered me and set me in a large place. Psalms 118, verse 5. Roll that intro. Do back to my channel before i get into it i want to give a big shout out to my brother-in-law for making this video possible pick up yourself thank you so much <laughs> so welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is rashida i do beauty related videos i'm using the superstore cream and i'm going to foundation review i already have my on so for me the next step is foundation because it's a review i'm going to just use a little bit of my black radiance primer that's it nothing i'm not overdoing my skin or that. i'm just using my black radiance primer all right It is a full coverage. I am going to wear this 
foundation shoulder day. It's approximately 2.38 and I'm going into the town. Um, I'm going into town to come back and I'll be out and about. The day is really, really hot. I'm just wearing my, um, oh my, uh, my base is just, the primer that I'm wearing under my base is from Black Radiance. That's it. No moisturizer, just a primer I'm wearing under my base. And um, yeah, so let us just test this foundation to see if it is what it claims to do. I list everything on the screen. I let you guys know when I'm editing all the details of the foundation. But um, let's just test this out and see. I'll come back to you in a couple of hours to see how it holds up. I did not bake. I just put powder under my eyes and just set my face like how I always do it. And that's when I put too much bake. So I am going to go on the road in the town to come back and um, I'll let you guys know and then I'll give you a, my finished thoughts on it. That's pretty much it. It's looking good. I'm looking for full coverage on this side, in my opinion. More full coverage on this side. This side is looking natural. It's looking full coverage too, but when I compare the two, I don't know if it has a good side. <laughs> but I, um, yeah, so let me go on the road and come back because we're waiting on me. Let me go on the road and come back when I feel errands or when I'm out in the sun. Well, so let me go and I'll um, check back with you guys a few hours. So, right, guys. See you guys. So, hey guys, welcome back. I'm back. I just came back home, was on the road at lunch. So, I'm ready to wrap this up. So, I am wearing the Maybelline Super Stay Foundation. Super stay foundation and in the shade 334 warm sun. Alright, this foundation has a shade range of 12 shades. Based on my knowledge on their website, the price point in the US is $11.99 and in Jamaican dollars it is well I pay $2,500. Shape, the price is fluctuate. Depends on the store, you can find it for different, different prices, depends on sale. But currently, right now, this is the price point for it. Foundation it is full coverage. It, it claims to be full coverage and it is full coverage. Alright, so this is not a first impression. I've used this foundation on clients myself to work. It is it is full coverage. It claims to be matte. A matte formula, it is a matte formula, but you have to add powder to enhance that to get that mattifying look. So, it, it, it honest review, it doesn't stay matte on its own, it needs something to keep it matte. But it is a matte foundation, all right. On the bottle, it has information here. So um, it is a full coverage foundation, goes up to 24 hour in terms of wear. I am not able to give you a comment on that because I've never um, had this foundation on my face for 24 hours. So I am not sure if it goes up to that. Um, seamless matte finish. It is breathable and comfortable. It is, in my opinion, it does, even though it's a full coverage drugstore foundation, you're not feeling foundation on your face. It's like, yeah, you know, you have a foundation, of course, but you're not feeling that cakiness, alright? Alright, it is oil free, doesn't clog pores, but in, based on my experience with the foundation, I haven't got many breakouts, clogging up pores, you know, so that's a goal for me, alright? Um, yeah, and that's pretty much it. So I'm going to come close to the camera so you can see. I have experienced a lot of oils because I told you guys I just had a primer from Black Radiance underneath the foundation. I did not um, add any extra moisturizer. I allowed the foundation to work on its own for me to give you a true live honest review. So I have experienced in oil. I have. I am experiencing oil. 
on my T-zone areas. So there's areas that looks flawless, just the same. And I'm, I'm, there's a little bit of partition here, separation here in my smile lines. Because I always, no matter the foundation big, I always get some creases here. So I might have a problem here. But I'm experiencing it more on this side where I use a beauty blender compared to the brush. I'm going to come close to the camera so you guys can see the details. So up close and personal. So is it look guys you see in these smile lines here? Break away there and compare to here. That was bad. So yeah, not looking pretty bad, but you're seeing the oil on my nose and so pretty much you have to build this foundation for it to be a matte foundation with your additional products. Alright. Alright, thank you guys so much for watching my video. I hope you continue to stay tuned. Check out my other videos that I have on my channel. Please free to leave a comment, a feedback, videos that you like to see me do, ways how I can improve my content, my little habit. But yeah guys, this is the review on the Maybelline Super Stay Foundation. All the best guys.